I came for a sensation all 2019 and I'm gonna keep coming for them until they get it right. I need a proper, okay? Is this thing on? <laughs> Happy days and welcome to my channel. I'm back today with another video. So before we get into it, today's video is brought to you by Diva Trust. So shout out Diva Trust for sending me this beautiful unit in exchange for an honest review. All right, so you guys, um, I also would like to leave some resources for you guys to check out some other wig reviews on this unit. Half Baked Hair Reviews did a review on this unit and Tiffany Baby did a review on this unit and it looks beautiful on both of them. So I will leave links to both their videos in the description box down below so that y'all can check them out because I think both of them did a way better job slaying this unit and I did it don't really fit my head <laughs> that's the issue that I'm having the unit we're gonna be reviewing today is Liana by sensational this is from their new HD lace collection which is also within the wet lace collection so I do have it in the color 1b this unit retails for about $65 I will put the most updated and accurate pricing on the screen for you all so that y'all can see um, what it's going for on Diva Dress website um, so yeah, the biggest thing with this unit is the HD lace feature, which is new because as y'all know, we all had issues with the lace being really, really ashy last year and the year before. And so, yeah, upon seeing this lace straight out the package, I was not impressed. It did give off a very ashy vibe in my opinion, but once I actually put it on my head and got it situated, I was able to see it for what it was. It's actually a really pretty lace color. Um, so when you place it, when you hold it like this, like I said, it looks ashy, but then when you put it on your skin, you can kind of see how it does become transparent because that's what HD lace is supposed to be. For my quick little Google search I did, um, it just says that HD lace is supposed to be transparent and it's supposed to be applicable to anyone of any skin tone so i think that it does its job like just seeing this how it does that it, it just really i feel like it's doing what it says it does i'm seeing it like this i thought it was really ashy it was giving off real ash vibes to me and so i was like i'm not trying to look ghostly so i went ahead and tinted the lace like i was honestly upset in the original footage um but like i said when i look back over it when i look back over the footage i was like it's not that bad um and so yeah i do like this lace i do approve this lace because y'all know i was real hard on the wet lace collection units last year moving on to the specs of this unit the cap construction there are two combs at the front just under the 13 by 6 lace parting area and there is a comb at the nape so the um color i do have is 1b i've noticed that with the new wet lace collection unit sensational has stopped offering those really pretty colors like the money piece blonde money piece hazel bring it back <laughs> running back because the money piece blonde color is everything okay you guys it's everything but i just wish they offered some more color options because i'm just a little bored but i do like it um so the density of this unit i feel like it's very thin i said that when i took it out the package it's just very like flat but all of my tracks are covered so that makes me happy but i still just i guess it's giving off a more human hair vibe and less synthetic um so you know it's an improvement i suppose but i just like my wigs to just be a little bit more fuller um i just have one of those faces i just like just a little bit more hair um so yeah so the texture of this unit it's like a silky texture you can run your fingers through it for the most part i was noticing that as it was just laying on my head and it was colliding with my neck it was starting to like tangle up in this area which was making me really unhappy but i was able to brush through it fairly easy so you know to combat it you know it's not too much work but still i don't like that it was doing this, this unit is pretty much ready to wear straight out of the package as long as you take advantage of the hd lace you can apply your powder on top and be just fine um so yeah it doesn't take too much work to get her ready um and i forgot to mention this when i was talking about like the texture of the hair and the tangling and all of that but this hair does shed i'm literally just looking on the floor like i just got so much shed hair all over like it's really bad i don't like that but i guess it comes with the territory and is this unit big hair friendly i've seen other people say that it is and compared to other wet lace collection units which are extremely big hair friendly to a point where even I had to adjust my straps. I would not say that this unit is big head friendly. Like just this right here. Like I don't like this. Like can y'all see if I had to glue it. It would just pop right up. Like I just don't feel like this is as roomy. As some of their other caps have been. Um, but that's just my opinion. You know. 
I don't know my head is like extra large like alien size so maybe it is big differently just not big enough for my head I don't know I don't know okay um this is an everyday wig I would say that it is it's got a like really nice like toned down kind of vibe so I do think that this unit could be nice for everyday wear but that is pretty much everything that I had to share with you guys about this unit let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about this unit once again make sure that y'all check out Diva Trust website for all of your purchasing options it will be in the description box down below um but, but yeah i love you guys so so much thank y'all so so much for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye loves